Hi there. Doug Niedermeyer, Omega Membership Chairman. Larry Kroger. This is... This is my roommate, Kemp Dorfman. Hi there. Doug Niedermeyer. And these are our name tag hostesses, Mandy Pepperidge and Hi. Fab Jansen. Hi there, Kent. Hi, Larry. Hi. Welcome to Omega House. Thank you. Nice to... Why don't we just go inside and meet some of the guys, huh? Wimp and a blimp. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of great guys here tonight, so don't feel you have to meet everyone. We just want you to enjoy yourselves while you're here. the other fraternities on campus, and they're far superior, I think, to man. Hi. Hi there, fellas. I get to meet Ken and Lonnie. Larry. Ken, Lonnie, I'd like you to meet um, Larry. Muhammad, uh, Jugdish, Sydney, and Clayton. Now, just grab a seat and make yourselves at home, and don't be shy about helping yourselves to punch in cookies. But a lot of outstanding guys figure they'll pledge Omega or they won't pledge at all. We do have more than our share of campus leaders. Something that never looks bad on your permanent record, Chip. Well, sure. Everybody I talk to says Omega's the best, but I, I hate to seem, you know, pushy. Let the unacceptable candidates worry about that, because after tonight, there you are, uh, Kent. I'm Greg Marmalard, president of Omega House, and I'd like you to meet my friends, Mandy Pepperidge. Hello. Hi, we already met. And Chip Diller. How are you? Hi, how are you? And uh, over there is Terry Arbach, captain of the swim team. And that's Carl Phillips, editor of the Daily Fabarian. And uh, Clayton, Sidney, Jugles, Muhammad, Lonnie. Uh... Yeah, we already met. Oh, super! Then you'll have lots to talk about, huh? Yeah. I don't know, Larry. I don't think you're trying very hard. I hate this. Look, no sweat. My brother Fred was a Delta. That makes me a legacy. They gotta take me. It's like their law. Don't worry. I'll put in a good word for you. Great. I heard Delta's the worst house on campus. <laughs> Sir, is this the Delta House? Sure. Come on in. Chapter 
president. Hi, Robert. Katie, have you seen Boone? He disappeared the minute we got here. Probably upstairs talking to Otter. No doubt. They're well-known homosexuals. <laughs> have another beer, Larry. She's just kidding. <laughs> right, Pluto? You going out tonight, Otter? Uh-huh. Norma? No, let me give you a hint. She's got a couple of major league yabos. Beverly. No, but you're getting warmer. Let me give you another hint. Does this ring a bell? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Marlene. Don't tell me you're going to pork Marlene Desmond. Pork? You're going to hump her brains out, aren't you? Boone, I anticipate a deeply religious experience. Why are you so interested in my social life? Where's Katie? Downstairs, pissed off about something. She thinks you're an immature jerk, huh? Yeah. I don't take anything seriously. She'll take this seriously. Try it. Hey, are you guys coming down? This thing talk. There happen to be 50 people downstairs waiting to try and get into this fraternity. Otter, you are the Rush chairman. I think you should be present at the Rush party. Hi, my name is uh, Kent Dorfman. Hey, Eric Stratton, Rush chairman. Damn glad to meet you. <laughs> D-Day! Hi, Eric Stratton, Rush Chairman. Damn glad to meet you. Hi, that was Eric Stratton, Rush Chairman. He was damn glad to meet you. Oh, Larry, good. I see you've met D-Day. Good, you're having a nice time. It's good, good. Eric Stratton, Rush Chairman. Damn glad to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice tie. Is that a clip on by any chance? Hey, Boone, come over, check me, this pardon out. Me. Uh, excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah. Pardon me. Oh, 90% rayon. Very nice. Hi, boys. Having a good time, I hope. Excuse me one second. Hey, did your mother buy that for you? Yeah. Uh, uh, Kent is a legacy otter. His brother was a 59, Fred Dorfman. He said legacies usually get asked to pledge automatically. Oh, well, usually, unless the pledge in question turns out to be a real closet case. <laughs> like, like Fred. Fred. <laughs> My brother. Kent, come on over here. I like the tie. Great tie, don't you think? 